Hello and welcome back to another video on essential formulas for electrical level three. So I'm going to start, there's my different colour pens. Now this one is not really a formula as such. Um, we're using this word Sybil as a, as a mnemonic. So this is, um, let's call it uh, AC theory. AC theory. And a few things that we need to write. So we always talk about current. So if you can write down for me, um, current is always leading or lagging voltage. And the word that we use, this mnemonic, is civil. I like them quite big. Civil. And now let's write down what each of those means. So, C is a capacitor. Um, current, uh, I, sorry, I stands for current, that's the formula symbol. V is voltage. I again is current and L is an inductor. So we'll C actually stands for capacitance, L stands for inductance but we shall leave it at that. So the way we use this is if you have a, a capacitor in your circuit, if you've got a purely capacitive circuit, you will just cover up the second half. So if we just cover up that, we've got capacitor, current, the word current is coming before voltage, so my current leads voltage, comes before. And if I had a purely inductive circuit, I'll just cover up this side. So I've got voltage, current, and inductor. And you'll see just in the words here, the word current comes after the word voltage. So in an inductive circuit, current lags voltage. So let's write that down um, in a sentence. And we will highlight some of the... Um, Important word, so in a let's see, we shall you yeah, we could use them in a capacitive circuit, passive circuit, uh, the current. current um, is leading is leading the voltage and my sentence in and um, Inductive circuit the current is lagging the voltage. And uh, there we go, I hope that helps you uh, know how to use this mnemonic Sybil. Thank you for watching the video. Remember, we've got plenty of other videos on all of the other tests that you can do, and there are also many videos on cable calculations and all sorts of things that you're gonna to need to know to complete level two and level three in electrical installation.
Now if you want my tabs that I have, like my BS7671, visit the website electricalstudent.co.uk where you can purchase those. Also on the website, loads of free stuff, loads of practice tests, mock exam questions and such like. Working with electrical insulation guys, remember, be safe. Most importantly, listen to your lecturers, he or she definitely knows best. Take care guys, see you soon.